Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to part 8 of Let's Play Europa Universe Dallas 4 Golden Century Extended Timeline The Byzantine Ambition in the last part we um we're pretty much preparing and now the first thing we need to do is get these fucking shitty ass bloody merchants dealt with now Constantinople let's have a look let's have like a proper look at this a Ragusa is worth fuck all so I'm gonna make Constantinople the king of my area so we'll be collecting trade from there we're transferring trade from here. Um, and we'll be we'll, uh, play a day. There we go. We have to play a couple days to get our guys back. And uh, we'll transfer trade here. Okay, we have got uh, the guy in Crimea is still. There we go. Um, let's fucking transfer trade from here. There we go. That should make us a lot more money. Look at that. Trade is now actually going to be fucking efficient for us. So uh, look at that. We've 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 gone from like having like no trade to a decent amount of trade. That actually that income also allows us to pay for ourselves. Sorry, let's do one second. So uh, takes them back a friend, which is weird because it's, it's nearly two in the morning. But anyway, uh, bribe. Oh fuck you, game. Bribes growing more uh, acceptable. They're not acceptable. We just don't really care enough either. Right, if we're gonna be serious, let's just let's wipe out the uh, the uh, debt as quick as possible without losing our using like losing money. Fucking hell, we're losing it pretty quickly, so that's good. Nice and quick. Get the, get the, get the fuck rid of that. Right, um, so at the moment, once our income starts, obviously, getting, we got to get our income back and start spiking again. Um, we'll uh, declare war on... See, the almonds have such a good... Like, everyone has such an advantage over us in tech. Like, when's the next uh, tactics tech? 49. So they have a tactic advantage on us as well as, like, oh, obviously all the other advantages as well. Um, to get tech cheaper, we'd need to, you know, raise the money for um, medicine, which honestly is probably the smartest thing to do, actually, now that we've, uh, now that we can. So if we raise money for the med medicine, get medicine done, or we could raise money for having a massive army and, you know, attack the almonds and just... Do our best. To, well, to be fair, the Almonds are in no position. Like, at the moment, ladies and gentlemen, we've been again shafted by the fucking Alliance system. Now, see, I'm, I'm actually playing a game at EU3 at the moment, ladies and gentlemen. And I started in... Well, EU3 is obviously... Depending on ha who, who... Depending on whose experience you go from, EU3 is either really easy in comparison or why the fuck is it so complicated? And, like, there's two camps. People, Some people think it's got a way too steep a learning curve. Some people think it's really easy. I, I think it's really easy, admittedly, but... Even a harder start in that game is easier than this. Because of the way that... Uh, it, this game is definitely, obviously, like a massive improvement. But there's just so many sh shitty systems on it that I have to put up with. And uh, this shitty-ass alliance one is the best, is the worst. All we need to do is, obviously, you know, grow, grow some way, shape, or form. But I don't want to grow too much or the Mamluks are going to want to fucking kill me. Because we know how big a wankers they are. 17,000 men, though. Like, It also doesn't help that we have no actual way to get over there straight away. What do you fucking mean, Macaro? Oh, unbalanced research. That's army maintenance. I go pay whatever it takes to, you know, shut this uh, inflation up. Uh, and research is just going to have to be on balance for a while. It's it's not something I can do anything about. Ask for some contribution because we I want to get this paid off as soon as possible. That way my tech will go back to being cheaper. And uh, we have quite a few years until the Renaissance then. Um, with our alliances, we sh really should be able to beat the Ottomans as long as... It's the Golden Horde that is really like, cutting it fine at the moment. Like, they're causing the issues. Uh, my navy, when I'm, uh, I'm obviously when I feel confident enough to build it up, we're not going to have any trade ships. We're just going to have everything be probably ten thousand, uh, ten sorry, ten ships, so I can move ten thousand men. 
And then uh, the rest is going to be galleys. Yeah, so I need one more ship and then we'd have... Uh, ooh. So we'd have... We've already got three galleys. We'd have 13 galleys. Against the Ottomans, how good would that be? I'm going to say fucking pointless, but... Oh, look at that. I would be wrong. Huh. It's not every day I'm wrong. It's not that infrequent either, but... Uh, what can you do? Again, a nice amount of money. 6.12 is actually a good amount of money for the position we're already we're currently in. Get this paid off nicely. Right, and there we go. We've got medicine up. Perfect. Uh, obviously, our uh, corruption is zero again. Our uh, prestige is horrid, I believe the uh, phrase is. Only, it's ever-increasing, though, so that's a good thing. You want to use so you cost 10 gold a ship we're gonna need 100 ducats to get uh, all 10 galleys i'm just gonna build them as often as i can like try and keep them there kandar killing you would actually be fucking lovely caraman and sue uh, so you'd only be like these two these yeah again though the real problem is the getting through the ottomans once i once i could get through the ottomans I, it wouldn't be a problem but it, getting through them is the initial problem. Which, of course, we are trying... I am trying to remedy by building up a fleet. Building up my fleet. Eventually, we'll max out my military. And, yep, I want that trading. I want those goods produced. It's only an extra 5%, but even 5% can be fucking good. I don't know if it's already gone up. Okay. Probably already went up. That's fine. Uh, Sardinia, Juan, Noir. Sardinia, you are allied to Aragon. You are with Castile. You're part of the Empire. Aquilia, part of the Empire. Tunisia, allied with way too many good people. You're a vassal of the Mamluks. As you can see, ladies and gentlemen, there's not many options. These guys are technically one of our better options, but at the same time, not really a better option. Y you know what I mean. It's one of those options that's like, yeah, you could do this, but why? You know, as the, as Johnson, as John Tron would say, I'm hoping my fucking subscribers know who John Tron is, or I'm gonna look like a right twit, twat. Doesn't really matter. Uh, almonds, be at war. Okay, you got rid of alliance, but you got rid of the wrong fucking alliance. You cunts. <sighs> Trying not to swear. Everything's I've been like working. I've tried to cut down my swearing, but some things, ladies and gentlemen, just fucking grind my bastard in gears. And yes, ladies and gentlemen, I just added swear words in for fucking emphasis. And same then. Um, so you're, this is our target, Mentis. Mentisha. Mentessa. Whatever, they're going to be dead soon. It's their allies that are a problem. Duh. Is it duh? No, I think it's those two and that one. Which means we need a big ally army. A bigger army than we've got. Sorry, it wouldn't be more accurate. Or just another 17,000. Uh, another 17,000 would work quite well. I personally think. Now oh, we could, I mean, yeah, 17,000. I think that's what we're going to have as our empire, our, um, our army size. Now, I would build them out of mercs, but let's have a look. Just, just, just have a look how expensive mercs are. Oh, like one gold more. Oh, no, they're not. They're just double the price, essentially. So, um, a big fuck that to that, if I'm honest. I would rather just raise the money. Get in debt and, you know, beat the Ottomans that way. It's safer that way. The only real problem is the Golden Horde. They're, they're, they're the biggest problem in this, uh, like, situation. Um, yeah, I don't need that up for now. Just, let's, uh, just to if, I can. if I had to attack you, only Wallachia would help. Serbia is too, it's too distant for them to give a fuck about. It's not even that far away. You can't. It's like saying you won't go over your nan for tea because she's too far away. That's just fucking rude, mate. Um, the Ottomans are obviously, yeah, they're going to be our prime war target for ever at this point. Yeah. Finding people to help me is never in my good luck. Like, I always get alliances that cause me so many problems. And I over worry. I, I, do, over wor I do worry way too much. That's definitely something I, uh, I have to admit. So if we were looking at militaries, how big is the Golden Hordes? 34,000. 
with the Ottomans at I probably I must have gone past them because I'm, I'm blind obviously yeah they are 18,000 yeah the Ottomans have 1,000 more men than me if I was to double my army size I would be literally as big as the Golden Horde in which case I would still need more men Venice, uh, sorry, Naxos, you need to, actually, Venice, you need to fuck off, if we're honest. Killing you, if you didn't have this trade league, would be so fucking good. Uh, Mentees, yeah, oh, wait, you've got Radio Reliance with Car uh, Caraman, I think it was. Oh, was it these guys? No, it's these guys you got Radio Reliance with. I think you're rid of the ones I actually wanted you to get rid of, could you, you fucking wanker. Killing you would be Karaman and Take. I'm contemplating whether or not these like these guys would be smarter to kill. Because they're closer to me, so I could just, you know, go pop pop army, pop army down, pop army down. It'd be really quick in comparison. Um also, on a more important note, um, I wouldn't have to. I mean, there, there, there's like no land, but it's going to be easier to deal with like these guys and Takei than anyone else, I'd say. Though we can still obviously take out Takei and then you know some take some Caraman land just to be a wanker if I uh, if I can get if I get around to it. Uh, again, all we need now is more land and we'll be fine. The second we get some more land, we're going to be all oh, your war Muscovy. Again, the only ally I don't want to join would be the Golden Horde. Right, how much would it take cost to build up the exact same army I already have? It would cost 190. Ooh, that's a bit. Uh, that's a bit many. Hmm. And it would also cost 4.18 a month. So essentially, we would definitely be bankrupting ourselves if we did this. The second the Golden Horde cannot join, ladies and gentlemen, we got we have to fucking join. I already borrowed money. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Uh, fuck there. Go here. Uh, now, the the plot of the idea of this is to take all of this land over here. Leave this for now. I, uh, like, we don't give a fuck about that unless it's bigger so I can, you know, get a bit closer to these cunts so I can, you know, walk over to them and kick them in the foot teeth. Like, if I'm going to kick someone in the teeth, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to fucking do it in person because I'm a polite bastard. Yeah, and also, this is, we need to make sure we do this right before the war starts so, you know, we don't, uh, fuck it up. <laughs> And, you know, ruin our income. More so than it's already going to be sent into the spiraling shitscape that it's, it's, going, it's going to be going into. Right. Um, we can take 61 loans. That's good to hear. Because we're going to be quite in debt. Prep the men. There we go. I'm not going to really pay any of these loans off right now. We're going to hold off on that. Just a little bit longer, and the uh, Golden Horde will have nothing to do with them this war. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this could very well fuck the entire uh, this entire run through, but that's fine. I like I said, I still intend to you know keep. Uh, in, I still intend to like you know keep doing this until we win, because that's uh, going to take a fucking age. Then that's a that's a fucking horrid general. Give me another. Fuck you! You're all horrible. Also, you really can't stand there. So I mean, I'm going to need. Uh... Oh yeah, we're going to need to slack and recruit my standards horribly.
There we go. We can stand there. Couple more moments, ladies and gentlemen. The Golden Horde will reject the call for her, uh, the, uh, uh, the ability to help, and we will be able to fuck these guys. Hopefully, Serbia will prove to be useful. Ottomans, how many men do you have now? Rivals, let's just stick to rivals. They have 28 fa- oh, fuck. They, um... They called their best friends up, and their best friends were like, Sup, homies, let's fucking do this. Essentially, what that means is... Yeah, fuck. Pretty much, yeah, fuck. That, that's pretty much what we're going for here. Right, let's do this. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I am fully aware that this could fucking backfire, kill, shoot me in the face, and, you know, essentially be the end of this run-through. Like I said, I'm fully aware of that. What I'm also aware of is that this needed to ha needs to happen, and again, all I want is... I mean, let's go for the hunt. Like, that would be the perfect war goal. Actually, no. It'd be that. I'll probably take Macedonia over that to be like, breathe this so I can block them off from the sea here, there. You know, I'm fully aware the AI is, uh, sorry, not the AI, yeah, the, uh, my enemy is, uh, and why the fuck did you take that? You can't. You're taking my land. What the fuck you doing? Yeah, you're actually, you know, stopping me from taking what I want. Oh. Because of the way we assault, we've come across here. We can't actually, you know, go the way I wanted to go. I'll get over there. And Serbia is actually fucking me. They're taking all of that land and leaving me with literally none of it. Absolute bellends. I asked you to help as an ally. I didn't ask you to take on my land. I may have to go for uh, just my cause at this point. But, I mean, slow but steady, as they say, ladies and gentlemen, wins the race. I don't know why they say that. It's a fucking shit saying. Fuck them. They've said it and it's done. And, you know, we just have to accept that now. Can we assault there? Because I'm really fucking contemplating it. Like, winning this war is a very, like, we just, all we need to do is win this war and we've, like, before they finish their other war and we're golden. Yeah, so we're going to go uh, get that back, get these now. You know, because we actually, ha we need, we want them. All right. All right, let's uh We're very close to getting uh the three main provinces I want. It looks like that was going quite well to get those ones. There we go, another decent-ish leader. Sure, I'll lose naval tradition. I don't actually give a fuck about my naval tradition, so you're more than welcome to it. Okay, we're very close, ladies and gentlemen. We're very close to a peace deal that uh, is agreeable. I mean, I'll admit this is way more agreeable to me, but let's not be greedy fucks now. Uh, I'm not really. I don't really want to engage this enemy navy. I can't recruit an admiral. Uh, can I borrow some diplo from some boy, some boys? You need 25 influence. I don't have enough land to give you 25 influence, so I'm gonna have to ask that you kindly stop. Once that ongoing battle's done, we should be able to get some peace, ladies. Oh, fuck me, that's not good. 
Actually, we have combat ships. They don't. Damn. Uh, what's a nice cheap province? You know what? Fuck it. We're very close to getting that one. Fuck them. We'll uh, we'll stay in this war. My loans aren't crippling me too badly. Holy shit, my loans are fucking destroying me. If we get this siege though, we should be able to get a decent, a little bit more land than we... Uh... Like right now, we can get what I want. But again, like I'm ever going to increase what I want just to see how much we can get. And if I'm honest, that is the dream. You know what? No, you know what? The one I've just, like, the last one I picked, that, that was, that's the new dream. Okay, the almonds are only at war of us now, so. Yeah, that's not good. The almonds being only at war makes this way more annoying. Okay, we've got three months. That's all we need. We need to stop that cunt of an army. Um, if I lose to a 14k army, I will actually cry. Right. I uh, apparently need to cry now. Yep, should have accepted that. Yeah, we're going to accept this instead. Yep, fuck you. Get out of my face. Uh, you, go bye bye. Thank you. And there, ladies and gentlemen, we did it. <laughs> Though I didn't have to get rid of all of those. Okay, you guys go into Constantinople and uh, mothball the living fuck out yourself. Yeah, we're not paying for you either. <laughs> so we took out 14 loans in the end. But hey, we got some new states, ladies and gentlemen. All right, we got a new state. And we'll have this as a new state when we uh, get it caught. But, uh, yay, we got three provinces, ladies and gentlemen. And I hope you guys have enjoyed. And in the next part, we'll continue to fuck it up. I'll see you guys in the next part. See you guys then.